In August of this year, the world will be tuning in to Alien Earth, a groundbreaking new FX series premiering on Hulu and Disney+. This dramatised vision of humanity's first alien contact may be fictional, yet, strangely, it parallels something unfolding in reality right now. Hurtling through our solar system is a mysterious visitor known as Free Eye Atlas, only the third interstellar object ever detected. But unlike its predecessors, Free Eye Atlas has the astronomical community at a standstill. People are beginning to ask, what if this object is not natural? What if Free Eye Atlas is alien technology? The behaviour of this interstellar object is baffling astronomers, and for good reason. If the current observations hold true, it may be breaking some of the most fundamental rules of known comet physics. Astronomers are asking the question, is Free Eye Atlas performing an interstellar braking manoeuvre? And of course a braking manoeuvre would imply active deceleration, which in space is extremely difficult to explain naturally unless some external force or internal mechanism is involved. This object entered this solar system from interstellar space. It entered on a hyperbolic trajectory, and this means it's not bound to our sun, it came from another star system and is just passing through. Yet, preliminary orbital data suggests that it's slowing down, not due to gravity alone, but in a manner that some researchers speculate that this indicates non-gravitational forces at play. If this deceleration is confirmed and cannot be explained by solar radiation pressure or outgassing, then more radical ideas like artificial control must be considered. And this echoes the behaviour of the first interstellar object discovered in 2017, One Eye Oumuamua, which also decelerated anonymously without showing any detectable gas emissions or tail, and this prompted Harvard's Avi Loeb to suggest that it may be artificial. And get this, its tail is pointing towards the sun, and this is the first time that this has ever been observed in a so-called comet. The outgassing of this tail pointing towards the sun is mimicking an interstellar braking manoeuvre. This is where things get truly unbelievable. In every known comet ever discovered, the tail points away from the sun due to the force of the solar wind and radiation pressure. So why is Free Eye Atlas's tail pointing towards the sun? The tail pointing towards the sun, this indicates that this object is emitting material in the opposite direction of travel, which is causing it to slow down, and this is a textbook braking manoeuvre. And if this is proven to be deliberate or precisely aligned, then it could point to non-natural origins, like a propulsion system. And this of course, this behaviour is completely unprecedented in natural solar system comets. If Free Eye Atlas has highly unusual electrical or magnetic properties, then it may be interacting with the solar magnetic field in ways that reverse the expected orientation of the tail. But no known physics fully supports this for an object of this size, which is roughly 7 miles in diameter, but some estimates have it at 12 miles in diameter. We may be looking at an alien probe that is actively decelerating, emitting material opposite its trajectory, and displaying no standard cometary gases. The fact that its tail is pointing towards the sun, and this is the first time this has ever been observed in a so-called comet, combined with signs of possible braking, this demands a re-examination of assumptions. Could this be a reconnaissance probe, silently watching us as it drifts through our solar system? And get this, the mystic Baba Vanga. She foresaw a major alien-related event occurring this year, in 2025, during a global sporting event. And while her prophecies are unscientific and speculative, many of her past predictions have come true, including the 9-11 attacks and the 2004 Boxing Day tsunami. With the Summer Olympics 
and other global gatherings approaching. Some could wonder, could the stage be set for something far beyond sports? Whether it is a rock, a ship or a scout, this remains unknown. But something about it defies expectations. Maybe it is an alien technology. Maybe it is the long-awaited sign of life beyond the planet Earth. And maybe it's not coming to us, but calling on us to come out there. As Arthur C. Clarke says, we are either alone in the universe or we are not. Both ideas are equally terrifying. Anyway, the countdown is on. Keep your eyes on the interstellar object, Free Eye Atlas.